I challenged ChatGPT4 to read through my entire book and it did it in 15 seconds. And I'm gonna share with you the five main takeaways that I got from having ChatGPT read all 200 pages of my book. And then I'll talk about a little bit of how I did this and how you can utilize it to download books within 10 to 15 seconds, isolate the core messages, and then utilize that in your business, asking it questions, or how you can go about using this in your day-to-day -day life to download knowledge as quick as Neo does in the matrix. So starting off with what I learned is ChatGPT can actually read a full 250 page book in in about 15 seconds. I had struggled in the past with uploading PDFs that were even longer than 10 or 15 pages. So I don't know when this feature came out, but it's a game changer. So one other thing that I wanted to talk about is ChatGPT is extremely good at interpreting large language models. But here's the first problem that I encountered. ChatGPT can be a bit lazy sometimes. And the first issue was it only wanted to read the first chapter. But after a few iterations, I confirmed and convinced it to go ahead and read the entire book and pull the five core messages after reading everything. So without much further ado, let's dig in. Starting off at number one is achieving work-life balance. Now you can easily interpret this just by reading the title of the book and the back cover, but ChatGPT was able to pick this up, but let's see exactly what they had to say. Basically ChatGPT said this, the central idea of the book is that it's possible to balance a fulfilling career with the freedom to travel. You emphasize that this lifestyle isn't just for the select few, but is achievable for many people through strategic planning and leveraging remote work opportunities. I published my book in 2018, way before there were all these remote work opportunities out there. And now more than ever, is there thousands and thousands of opportunities for everyone out there to work online, to have more freedom in their personal life, and to be able to work from anywhere in the world. And ChatGPT was able to take this core message from the book and get it right on track with what I believe in and what I've been doing over the past 10 years. So moving on to number two is remote work can be a gateway to freedom. Now, what does this mean? And what did ChatGPT actually say? So here's exactly what ChatGPT had to say. Remote work as a gateway to freedom. You illustrate how remote work can provide the flexibility and freedom to travel while maintaining a career. This concept is reinforced by your own experiences and the practical advice you offer on finding remote work opportunities. So after reading this, this couldn't be more close than the overall message that I wanna get out of my book is, hey, remote work can open up the doors. It can get you out of Wildwood, Missouri, where I originally grew up and was born, and now I've been able to go and work and travel in over 100 different countries. So remote work is a game changer, and that is one of the core messages of my book and something that ChatGPT was able to pick up in 15 seconds. Coming in at number three is practical strategies for global career development. And again, what does this actually mean? Let's take a look at what ChatGPT had to say. The book provides concrete strategies and actionable steps for individuals to develop a global career. This includes advice on finding international jobs, handling logistical challenges like visas and accommodation, and transitioning careers to align with a more mobile lifestyle. Now, looking through my book and looking through a lot of the reviews on my book, one thing that people loved is they loved the actionable and practical advice that was given within this book. And it's one of the reasons it's become a bestseller. And I think this is why ChatGPT was able to pick this up fairly easily because I include a lot of examples, a lot of websites that are still really important today, and then actually things that people don't know about, but is something that they can read the book, implement that minute, and then get results from doing that. So you have the idea, you have the inspiration, and then you have the practical knowledge, and then you can implement it that same day. So moving on to number four is personal growth through travel and international work experiences. And here's exactly what ChatGPT had to say. You highlight the personal growth that comes from living and working abroad, including the development of new skills, broadening of perspectives, and the enrichment 
that comes from experiencing different cultures. Now, this take is extremely impressive because it was able to read this and generate in under 15 seconds. And again, this hit the nail right on top. This is a perfect summary of one of the core elements about going into my book that, hey, living abroad can open up new relationships. It can open up new doors for your career and for your personal development. So I completely agree with this assessment. So moving in at number five is the sustainability of the nomadic lifestyle. Again, this is another core pillar of my life, of my brand, and of course my book. And here's what ChatGPT actually had to say about it. A significant theme in the book is the sustainability of a nomadic lifestyle. You discuss how to make a living and working abroad a long-term reality. Not just two weeks, not just one year, not just a short vacation, but focusing on financial management, balancing work and leisure, and creating a fulfilling life that combines professional success with personal exploration. There you have it, folks. ChatGPT was five out of five. Those are some of the core elements in my book. And again, if you liked any of these things or they resonate with you and you wanna go a little bit deeper, I'm gonna leave a link below in the description where you get a free version of my audiobook, absolutely free today. And then I'll also leave a link below if you wanna buy it on Kindle, paperback, wherever. It's on Amazon and it makes a great gift for anybody in your life if you resonate with any of these ideas. So in conclusion, ChatGPT4 really knocked this out of the park. I've blown away. I've been using GPT for the past years and it has absolutely time and time again really blown my mind if you're able to utilize it correctly. Again, you're only as good as your prompts and your inputs. That's going to determine if you have good outputs. And pretty much GPT was five for five on this conclusion. So how can you actually use this to implement and change your life? One, you can read books and just ask it for insight. So you can upload a book and say, hey, I read this book a few weeks ago, but I'm trying to figure out what they meant by this segment or what part of the book mentions this and if they can give a short summary. So you can use it for essentially looking in a book, trying to get some of those insights, or you can just ask it questions saying, hey, ChatGPT4, I just read this book. I'm having this problem. What would the book ideas do for me to recommend to fix this problem? And it'll use that book as the source code to generate a solution to fix your problem or to give you more insights on how you can overcome it. Now, there's probably a thousand different ways that you can use this by uploading books, getting summaries, and then implementing it into your life or your business. If you think of something creative or if you have a good prompt, go ahead and leave a comment below. Make sure you subscribe because I'm putting out new videos every single day.